reality constitute the organisation. In that regard, I can do no better than remind you of the words of the late Angus Mitchell on his election as president of Rotary International for the Rotary year 1948 to 1949. Speaking in Rio in words which also tell us much about the extraordinary quality of the man himself, he said, I believe in the simplicity of Rotary. It starts when we become so friendly with the members in our Rotary Club that we just can't help pulling our weight. This makes it natural to become friendly with our associates in business. Having asked you to engage in the exercise, it's possibly fair that I indicate what my word or words would be. <coughs> Let me approach my answer to that question with a short, unoriginal story, which is set many years ago in an unidentified Asian country. A young boy was told by his father to say goodbye to his aged and very frail grandfather, whom the father was planning to take to a distant mountain where he would be left alone to die. The boy asked the father why his grandfather had been taken away and was told that he was now too old and frail to support himself or to contribute in a material way to the community. <coughs> After a period of thought, the boy demanded that he accompany his father and grandfather to the distant mountain. To the father's annoyance, the son refused to take no for an answer. Finally, the father angrily asked him why he insisted on coming. The answer was succinct. Because, the boy said, I want to know where to take you when your turn comes. <laughs> Most of you will readily guess from that story the words which I would write. They represent the central injunction of the three great Abrahamic religions of our world, Christianity, Moderate Islam and Liberal Judaism. In the words of the golden rule of the Quran, do as you would be done by. They seem to me to lie at the very heart of both the fellowship and the service which have combined in the past to define Rotary and what it should be and to have made it what it is. I gather where to proceed from here to a brief forum which Len will chair Having heard the questions of Jenny, it's not a question and answer forum. <laughs> it will, though, offer an opportunity, I hope, for some of you to indicate where you disagree with what I've said, and also perhaps for one or more of you to indicate what your word or words would be. Thank you. Thank you.